Hello everyone, we are doing a reading for our new moon in Virgo. This is going to be on the 14th and the 15th of September, so let's see what our messages say here. All right, working with my angel oracle cards, we have, I am leading you towards the answer to your prayers. Please listen to and follow the steps I am communicating through your intuition, thoughts, and dreams. Oddly enough, I do have a signs three-night workshop working on your intuition on the 12th, 13th, and 14th. So it's interesting. I've been really tuning in today already about, um, about like how people are so connected to each other and how it's not just about signs and symbols. It's about emotions and connections and vibrations and things like that. So that's what's coming up for our new moon. Um, there's no coincidence that this workshop is right around that moon uh, because I feel like it's really about sharpening your tools and your skill set. So this new moon, make sure that you're uh, breaking free of old chains, old habits, because we're all obviously starting a new chapter. So at the same time, we're letting go of something else that's no longer serving us. So I'm also feeling like partnerships are coming up, mentorships, things like that. It's a great time to take a class, great time to learn. Again, start something that intrigues you or inspires you, all the I words. I'm also getting um, E words as well. So um, investment, um, enlighten, um, intrusive, inward, that sort of thing. So pay attention, negative and positive to these words around this new moon. All right, we also have Omega. So I'm getting nutrition right away is coming up. Again, you are very in sync with others and it's just tuning into those emotions just a bit more because sometimes we're not giving ourselves enough credit for where we are. So where we were talking about feeling more enlightened, I do feel like you're walking towards uh, a time in your life where things are going to get better, but there might be some fears that you're working through. Really, really, really scared to, to walk into that next chapter. So be mindful of the fear that that's coming up. Virgos are actually naturally very grounded. Um, they like nature. They like animals, probably where this connection stuff is coming up with vibrations. Um, they're also very driven towards being successful. So they're really into working hard. So one side of that is just making sure that you're not overworking or overdoing things. Um, and I am doing a grounding workshop on September 21st as well. So that's something you can also hop into through horsemanreadings.com, read about it. I have a video about it as well. Uh, you can always find that underneath my YouTube channel, Horseman Readings. You'll, you can see my link tree in the description or um, in the comments and, uh, and click on that, you'll find it. Uh, so the other thing too is it feels like with relationships at this time, um, don't bend over backwards for other people. This is really a time where we are going through our own journey and we're working on being independent and that sort of thing. So yeah, so just make sure that you're um, dotting all your I's, crossing all your T's, but at the same time, um, investing back into yourself, your dreams, your hopes, desires, and again, clear any negativity around uh, like where you haven't been able to invest in yourself or where you, um, you know, feel like other people didn't care enough about you or want you and things like that. All right. So very interesting reading. I already did a bunch of research on this new moon, but for some reason, I just felt like using my intuition and not focusing as much on that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll also have my dailies out, um, my weekly as well. I have monthly readings too. So I'll soon be doing an October reading. Wow. I am doing a free giveaway today underneath my live through TikTok. That's at 315 Atlantic Standard Time. So uh, feel free to become a subscriber or um, pay $15 to get a reading as well. Be there for my giveaway. All right, guys, take care. Love you all. We'll see you then.